hello lovelies welcome once again to my channel hope you all are doing great if today is your first time welcome and thank you so much for coming don't forget to subscribe if you haven't and to my subscribers thank you so much today we are making beef in vegetable sauce it's actually one of my favorites guys and it's so simple and easy to make let's get started that's our beef steak and is our main ingredient for this dish. Here I have my simple vegetables. I have my carrot, red, yellow, and green bell peppers together with some red onions. So first of all, I'll start by slicing or cutting our beef across the grains. This will enable it to cook easier and tasty as well. The only way you can enjoy this recipe is by using only boneless beef, okay? So as you can see, I'm using boneless beef, okay? So going ahead to cut it further into smaller pieces. So this dish is actually one of my favorites. I love beef in vegetable sauce. It's actually one of my favorites. After slicing or cutting our meat, I will go ahead and wash it as many times as possible to make sure I remove some of the blood content in the meat. Okay, so after washing it, I'll then drain it to make sure all the water content in the meat or even if not or at least some 70% of the water content will go out before I use our meat. So going ahead to also start mixing our ingredients. Here I have my soya sauce and then time for me to start adding my oyster sauce. If you don't have oyster sauce, you can use only the soya sauce and adding a little bit of honey and that's totally optional. Adding some garlic and then some ginger as well. So our meat is drained and I'm going to add it into our mixture and just added a little bit of cornstarch and a little bit of salt okay to taste yeah so mixing it all up and i'll just cover it for some few minutes before coming back to it in an empty pot i'll add a little bit of coconut oil you can use any oil that is available to you time for me to start adding in my marinated meat which I marinated for only 20 minutes because I didn't have all day and I will divide it into two because I want my meat to fry properly and tender. So this is the first half and it's almost ready for me to take it off the fire. You can marinate it overnight if you so wish. So look at that, it's ready and I'm going to take it off the fire. In an empty bowl, I will start by mixing our mixture. I will add soya sauce and then some oyster sauce. I will then add a little bit of cornstarch and then some amount of water. I will then mix it all up and set it aside, which I will use later on in the video. So after this, time for me to start mixing our vegetables and in an empty pot, I just added a little bit of coconut oil, some ginger, and then some garlic, which I grated. So after frying it for two minutes, I added my carrots and then red onions. So I'll go ahead and add broccoli, which I'm going to add a little bit of water and then cover it up to steam for two minutes. After two minutes, our vegetables have been steamed and time for me to add in habanero pepper because I like it a little bit spicy and then adding in some salt and then some all-purpose seasonings. So look at this, our vegetables is looking all gorgeous and it's so colorful, okay? I just love the color. So look at this, adding in more vegetables like i said we are making beef in vegetable sauce and so because of this you need to get a lot of vegetables in this sauce and our vegetables is so colorful 
so this is the time for me to add in our fried beef and after that i immediately added our sauce or our mixture that i mixed so look at this our sauce is almost done <laughs> thank you so much for always coming back to watch my videos guys this is a must try recipe okay just go ahead and try this recipe and you will thank me later and like i said earlier it's actually one of my favorite guys i'm going to take it with white rice look at that it's looking so delicious no it it actually tastes delicious guys thank you so much for always coming back to watch my videos please don't forget to subscribe if you haven't and then give your girl a thumbs up shalom peace out